In the 2019 New Year's Day special resolution, it was revealed that UNIT had been defunded and shut down, and this was a plot point that ran throughout all of Series 12 and its accompanying specials. And with Series 13 seemingly looking to be Jodie Whittaker's last series, the question is, will UNIT be in it? UNIT has of course been mentioned at least once a series in all of Jodie Whittaker's series so far, of course first in Resolution in Series 11, and in Spyfall in Series 12, so it would seem like a natural conclusion to that plotline would be in Series 13, we finally see UNIT once again. We also know from Doctor Who The Lonely Assassins, great game, go play it if you haven't already, that UNIT is still running just under the radar, so it is still there, it's just unknown about. This means it is open to having a return in the future, and isn't just still disbanded. Another thing you have to consider is that after Revolution of the Daleks, the UK government and governments of the world will probably have seen what happened unless there's some sort of miracle, but they will become more aware of extraterrestrial threats so they will understand the importance of organisations such as UNIT. So could we be seeing a new version of UNIT appearing in series 13 as a direct response to these alien attacks? It would be quite interesting if there was a plot point where UNIT had to stop the Doctor from getting involved because she is an extraterrestrial being, similar to how the Sokovia Accords affect the Avengers in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. We could have something similar here with UNIT actively being told to work against the Doctor as opposed to letting her help, which would be very interesting to see. One other thing to note is that Jodie Whittaker's era especially series 12 has a big emphasis on stories set on Earth as opposed to alien planets in space, and I'd love it if they did more set on alien worlds, but if they're going to continue with the trend of having them set on Earth, then it'd be really interesting if they did reintroduce UNIT as a force to help the Doctor on these Earth stories. Obviously from a lot of series 13 filming we have seen that a lot of the stories how will indeed be set on Earth. Another interesting thing to note is that Kate Stewart obviously the current owner, owner of UNIT, that's not the right word, the current person in charge of UNIT was originally first seen in a Chris Chibnall story, that being The Power of Three, which technically makes her a Chris Chibnall character and technically someone that he could bring back and write if he wanted to. I could see him doing that because he did originally introduce her and I can see him definitely bringing her back to write more of her again. And in a similar vein to that, if they do bring back Unit and Kate Stewart and people, I would really like to see them bring back Osgood. There are also many, many rumours of a Zygon story being in Series 13, with a set photo seemingly revealing some sort of Zygon technology making an appearance in the actual series itself. And Unit are intrinsically linked to Zygons on Earth, so if the Zygons returned, then it would be more than likely that they returned as well. Even if the Zygons aren't in Series 13, this Zygon technology might be salvaged by UNIT and being used for some other purpose than it was originally intended to be used for. All I'm saying is if some sort of Zygon technology or Zygons themselves are involved, UNIT will take notice and reappear. And in a similar vein to that, UNIT did encounter the Sontarans in the Series 4 two-parter containing the Sontarans, and from set photos, obviously we know that the Sontarans will be in the series, so again, if the Sontarans are on Earth, specifically modern day Earth, which we have seen, then UNIT would more than likely take notice. But I want to hear what you think. Do you think UNIT will be in Series 13? Do you think UNIT won't be in Series 13? Would you like to see Kate Stewart and Osgood return? Leave your thoughts down in the comments section below. But whatever you think, I've been Cyberman Alpha, and from me for now, it's goodbye.